So I was looking into uh, how many weeks and how many days we got left until summer. And it's around 18 weeks, um, which is 120, 627 days until summer. So it's a perfect time for everybody. I think I put on my shorts yesterday, but I want to have it as a long-term video so everybody on all of my followers can see it as well. Is that, you know, if you're serious about being in shape for the summer, you have right now the perfect time to start looking into how many calories, like start looking into your macros, right? How many uh, calories, the protein, carbohydrates, fats, all that stuff you should start cleaning and eating daily, um, maybe cutting or slowly uh, staying away from sugars. It's one of the bigger um, things that affects us from losing weight. Um, for example, myself, one of the keys for me to stay lean and um, lose weight, uh, I have to increase my cardio. Right now I'm doing about, um, roughly about, I do, so, so when I start my workout, I do 15 minutes of warm up on the stairs usually. Uh, then I do about 20 minutes um, after my weights. Depending, if I do legs, I do the bike. But if I don't do legs, I stay on the stairs and I do another, like I said, I do two, two, the 20 minutes. And I go on level eight, level nine. So my heart rate is, is still up the whole time and I get a good sweat. And um, I do also cardio in the evening, but I only do it four times a week. Uh, we're lucky enough that we have a treadmill at home. So I do about 30, 35 minutes in an incline fast walking and uh, I don't hold my hands uh, like I don't I don't put my hands on the handles that way you actually actually doing the most effort and you're burning the most calories so it's, it's key right now to start looking into it if, if you don't know how to do it properly there's a lot of help I can help you myself if you want to send me uh, an email or contact me in one of the comments I'll be able to help you out and give you some guidance of how many calories you should be consuming in a day um, and how would you start tracking your macros as well because it's super important especially when you um, when you um, going out in a restaurant with friends and stuff like that we think that having a salad is a good option but sometimes salads are even more calories than burgers they have so many they put so much say, um, so much um, sauce and dressings on it that it really bumps out the calories for the worst to be honest and um, so so yeah this just basically how to be smart on how to choose your food and um, drink a lot of water that's also key and um, also if if you would like to uh, help you speed up a little bit the process proper supplementation is also really good Having a multivitamin is essential. I'm a big fan of uh, having greens daily. I actually have like a little pre-workout. If you guys haven't seen my episode about the supplements that I take, um, I put my greens in my pre-workout. I noticed that they boost my energy. I, don't, I can't do too much caffeinated uh, supplements. And that's why I use a few other options. Uh, also, sodium intake is really important for you to be able to uh, absorb the water and keep hydrated. Um, what else? And, 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 and also like, I, I tell everybody, you know, like keep track of your results. Start like weighting yourself, start uh, measuring yourself and taking photos, super important. You don't have to do it all the time, especially, um, you know, you go on the scale every day, it's gonna fluctuate because sometimes you drink more water, sometimes you drink, have more sodium or eat more than, than some other days, but do it once a week. Set up a day, I recommend usually on Thursdays. So set up a day, um, do it first thing in the morning, empty stomach, very, very easy to do. Grab, go to the other store, get one of those tapes, um, to be able to measure your biceps, your chest, your um, waist, your tights, um, on 
and it, obviously your legs and keep track of it same thing if you need any help of how to do it properly um, please contact me send me a message and I'll be more than happy to help um, I'm not a big fan of going on the scale too much I go on the scale probably once a month to be honest sometimes I don't even do it for a long time just because uh, if you're trying to lose weight or the opposite you're trying to gain weight sometimes the scale don't really move much right but the measurements and the photos are super important those what really count that's when you see actually if you see some results and play around with your food too see what your body likes what your body is able to absorb um, we are all different our genetics and, and our systems are completely different so some food might work really well for me and some others won't work that well for you and don't don't do a diet do a proper meal plan diets i don't think they're that beneficial for you just do a proper meal plan so what i mean is cleaning up like i was telling saying earlier just cleaning up what you're doing and um, just uh, make sure you're consuming the right amount of calories okay guys well i hope this information is useful for you guys i'm gonna be doing a lot more video vlogs uh, kind of similar to this one kind of give you my my expertise and some of the stuff that i do on a daily basis Alrighty, and uh, see you guys soon.